as I'm sure you're all well aware, not conceding at home in the Champions League is very important in that first leg so we can go there with something to defend. Welcome back. We are on episode 21 of our restoration of Valencia. We are top of the league. Things are going very well. We have a Champions League tie to look forward to. This is the Football Manager is Ruining My Live YouTube series. And we have a title challenge on our hands, ladies and gents. We're looking pretty strong. We're looking pretty sturdy. I mean, we messed up the cup, as you can see, but... Things are going all right for us in the league. We've got two Champions League games for you this episode, both against Borussia Much and Gladbach. So we'll see how we get on there. League table looks really solid. We are five points clear of our nearest challenges in Real Madrid, which is excellent. Borussia Much and Gladbach next game, the home tie first, and then obviously, as you said, I messed up the cup. So press conference, Much and Gladbach are probably. I'm not going to say the worst, the best draw for us. because They're obviously a very, very good team, but there were some awesome teams still in the Champions League. So this is a really big chance um, to progress to the quarterfinals. And I'm sure they are thinking the exact same thing. So we'll see how we get on. Um, what we say in here, this press conference, Blanco, yeah, we'll honour our agreement because we're an honourable club. Does tend to show up when the spotlight is on him. Hopefully, get a few more goals from Gomez today. He's not been as clinical as the past. And if you watched the last episode, I said how he seems to have missed a lot more of his chances this season, which is rather irritating. Um, yeah, let's get on with these. These press conferences bore me. Just fine. Has anyone ever had it when it's not just fine? Okay, O'Sullivan, confident of a win. I am. We are at home. Our home form is really good. Uh, Benfica United, Barcelona, Liverpool. That'd be tasty. Revenge for Barcelona, possibly. Not quite. Not quite. So we're going to set up. We've got two formations. The home leg, we'll set up with a 4-3-3. Try and win the game. Try and keep a clean sheet, which is the important thing. Um, and then we'll go to Germany. Probably play a five at the back. Um well, depending on the result. If it's a draw, then we'll play five at the back. If we're ahead, we'll play five at the back. If we're struggling, then we'll go for it a bit more. We'll play the first game first. We go into our tactics. There's no transfers to tell you about. There's no contract extensions to tell you about. So we're going to get up a little bit. Get at, get at them a little bit. God, I can't talk today. Silly. All right, next match only. So, yes, yeah, so we're going to go 3-5. No, I'm not. We're going to go 4-3-3, like I just said. Make your mind up, Rob. So, really important the fullbacks get involved with the attacks. We need Geddes to step up. We need Maxi Gomez to step up. We're going to pop Lee Kang on the right wing because he is now fit, kind of, although he hasn't started a game for us for a while. This could be the one. Well, now I'm thinking, do I play Lee Kang? I just might have just talked myself out of that. I'm not sure. I have a think. Um, we could play that, I guess. Is that a bit risky? Is that a bit risky? We might try the new formation. I'm thinking about it. We have Lee Kang as an attacking centre midfielder, which means there's no pressure on him to get back as much. Sol and Vieira can sit. Musa on the right wing. Probably could play Gomez instead. We could bring Lee Kang on. Or do I start him on the right? I need to really, I really need to make my mind up, don't I? Uh, okay. Oh, sorry, I'm really messing about here. I can't figure out what do I do. 4 3 3 or 4. I'm going to go for this. I'm going to try it. We're going to play it. Lee Kang out wide, right hand side. I have Gomez on our attacking midfielder. And obviously Geddes on the left. Gomez up front. Sola and Vera to sit. Oh, it's a big game to be playing this formation. We've only played it a couple of times. It is the formation we played. We got dumped out of the cup to uh, Alicante, which was really annoying. Okay. Um, pump our fists. Do it for the fans. Give them something to cheer for. Give me something to cheer for. Um, very important. 
I don't have another choice. That's not what I want to say. Uh, it's a big match. You want players to be available to play. Perfect. Okay, so our form's not great. We lost a league game a couple of games ago, which is extra annoying. So here we go. Champions League, first leg at home. Really important that we don't concede. Okay, if we can draw, it's fine. We just can't concede. Okay, so early signs suggest that they're uh, looking a bit on top. Maybe I not underestimated them, but oh, where's the composure, Sillison? Just slammed it up the pitch. So Crummer. Okay, this is good press from us. Good press from us. Under control. Back in our possession. Let's go. Lee Kang into Gomez. To Maxi Gomez. Oh, pull the trigger. Still on. Still a chance. Geddes. Anyone? Somebody? Please? <laughs> Where's the ball? Oh, he's offside. Okay, so first key moment of the game has gone to us. Maxi Gomez has got a yellow card. Not too worried about Lee Kang has now got a yellow card. So, obviously, we're quite an aggressive tackling team. We always are of our tactics. Whew. Okay, so it's pretty cagey so far. Wow, that was a... Uh, so, I feel like I've really bigged this game up. And that was a very disappointing first half. So, we haven't conceded, which is good. We haven't really created much, which is quite worrying. So, we had... Kind of a half chance for Maxi Gomez, as you just saw. Um, we won't change anything at the moment because I don't think there's any need to. We will tell everyone to dig in, though. So let's dig in, find a little bit about ourselves, second half. They've made a change. Is that a potential change of tactic? I'm not sure. They still look like they're set up the same. Oh, Gomez. Got to take these chances. That's what I mean. We're missing big chances and they cook about to haunt us. That should have been a goal. Oh, I'm getting tense now. Okay, so make some changes. So Lee Kang looks tired. Um, we'll probably bring Musa Baron just for his purely for his pace. Uh, ugh, can't think now. Um, Carrera on at fullback position, maybe for Vass in a second. We'll deal with that. Musa in centre mid to be a driving force. I need to change the formation there, messing around. All right, let me try that again. Sorry. All right, undo that. Undo that. Okay. Change the formation. There we go. That's better. All right, so Musa, the Gomez, the attack is free. It's good. So Sergio Gomez has come out for Musa. Put him in the middle. That's better. Then it's probably got to be a career at some point, isn't it, for... One of the fullbacks of Vass can come off. Just a bit of legs on the wings there. So we've got half an hour to play. Formation looked good to start off with. We might be regretting it right now. And we've paid for it. Oh, corner. Bugger. That's not good. It's not good. So we have to go attacking now. Do I go ultra attacking? Just, I'll just have to go for it a little bit. One's really important. We've got to react. We've got to react to the goal. We've got to react to the goal. Guedes, Gaia, drill it. Gomez, yes! There we go. 1 1. Oh, come on. We've got to get a winner now because we don't want to go there with a draw, needing to score. So, Gaia does well on the wing. Gomez gets in front of his man, takes it on the left foot, on the volley. Excellent stuff by him. Do we go for it? Do we go for the win? Oh, goodness me. Let's go for it. Come on. Let's try and get that second goal. Try and get that second goal. Or have I, have I just screwed us over? Go on. Get that. Get a foot on the ball. Get a foot on the ball. Let's win it. Let's win it. No. Oh, we switched off again. Oh, it's such an annoying goal. to see. It's a big hoof over the top. Look at that. Touch it. He's not even facing the right way. Uh, Correa lost his man. It's a good finish by Turan, son of Lillian. We are really in trouble now. So we'll stay attacking. Hopefully we can nick one, can we? Please, this would be massive. Geddes, Gaia. Jeez. Oh, recycle, recycle, Gaia. 
Uh, keep going, keep going. Relentless attack, relentless attack is what we're good at. Guy again. Oh, Gomez. That's twice. <sighs> Free kick. Wasted. Not wasted, but... <sighs> that's ours. Right, Reese, calm, calm down, calm down. Pick a pass. Guy, forward pass. Good pass. Keeper's gone. Yes! Keeper's in no man's land. Gomez is on side, I think. Whoa. What a cut tie this is. Saliba out wide. Gaia, one touch up his feet. Looks up. Great ball, great run. Keeper's been caught. Gomez slots it in. I know he scored twice, but he could have had five. Can we get another goal? Okay, let's watch. Let's enjoy this tight offside, shall we? Come on, one more chance for us. One more chance. Oh, God, don't be. Don't, not like this. Like, come on, Moose. Go, go. Come on, get on that ball. Get on that ball. Get on that ball. Turn over and go. Turn over and go. Oh, wait. It's got to be ours. Yes, get it. Go. Drive. Drive. Pick a pass. Maxi Gomez. Oh, what was that? Ugh. That's not ideal, is it? I mean, we didn't lose. We've done really well to get the goal back. Should have won it. Gomez could have had five or six. He's going to come away as man of the match with two goals, but really, he should have done a lot better for us, shouldn't he? So, not going to be too harsh. Simply put, that wasn't good enough. Football about moments like this, yeah. I mean, I guess, but should have been in that position anyway. PSG a hammer in Tottenham. Yeah, lots of work to be done. Lots of work to be done. So we've got some league games coming up next. So we'll have a look at the schedule shortly. Honours even. Maxi Gomez. Have to praise his finishing. No way. He should have had loads more. Right, we're in trouble. We're, we're in trouble there, aren't we? So we've got a couple of games in between. Cadiz, Real Sociedad, Granada. Before we play the return legs, so I will go through these games now for you and show you the highlights. Highlight package. Well, probably get dumped out of a third cup there. So, obviously a 2-0 win here. So, needed to bounce back with a victory to keep our title challenge alive. Get it, slams one in, as he always does, because he's an absolute gun this season. Solo then penalty, makes it 2-0. And that's job done. We move on to the next game. So, completely in control of the game. 15 shots, 8 on target. Possession's in our favour. We then play Sociedad. Another penalty for Sola. Slams it in bottom corner. Keeper's gone the wrong way. and then. A very poorly conceded goal. I'm not quite sure what goes on here because oh, it's under the keeper. Irritating. So Sociedad obviously make it 2-1. Then with 25 minutes to go, well, half an hour to go. Vera on the ball. Slots it through to Gomez. Slots it through to who else? But Guedes. Composed finish. Rolls it in the corner. Big win for us. Yeah. Move on to 2 1 win, more shots on target, game dominated. You know, Granada next, this is annoying. So, another away loss in the league. Smash it, hit Suarez in the head. We didn't even show up for this. I don't think they could have had four or five. I don't know if we're fatigued. I had rested a couple of players with one eye on the uh, second leg, but just didn't show up at all. Look, no one watched his man, slots it through. Just <laughs> poor, poor play from us, if you see by the clips. So, yeah, five shots on target. Probably should have scored and done better, but they were just... Shots we had. The chances we had weren't very good either. So, we've got the second leg against Gladbach coming up. So, that does keep us top of the table, at least, those couple of games. It does mean Real Madrid and Barcelona are just creeping up on us a little bit, but we've still got a good run in to go. And if we get knocked out of this, and this is our... The league is our sole concentration going forward. So, we'll have Atletico and Real Betis in the next two games, which we'll show you in the next episode. Then we'll show you the Barcelona game. And then we'll just have a one big um, push to the end. Okay, so as you can see, still got a four-point lead. Barcelona, there or thereabouts. Atletico Madrid, there or thereabouts. We're going to finish in the top four. But let's move on to more pressing concerns. And that is the second leg against Gladbach. Two away goals conceded, which means we have to score in Germany. So, tactic-wise, it would be very, very interesting. Uh, 
press conference done. It's so windy here, by the way. So windy. Um, yeah, sawing ourselves a analyst, which is good. <laughs> Got to look after your staff in this game. Don't ignore the staff. Got to delegate. <laughs> Okay, so Levante, our uh, rivals, have done us a favour there by slowing Atletico Madrid down. We've got Atletico on the horizon. I did say at the start of this season, I don't feel like we had the squad to battle on multiple fronts, so I have to prioritise. And if you're giving me the choice of winning the league or going far in the Champions League, I'm taking the league all day long. So, But I would like to go far. <laughs> I just don't think we have the players, we haven't got the depth, the quality and depth to... Uh, Challenge on multiple fronts. It's probably a good thing we got dumped out of the cup as well. So, same similar tactics to last time. Only this time we'll change the formation round. So, we'll try and soak up our pressure and then we'll punch it. So, we haven't got Geddes for this game because annoyingly he got injured beforehand. So, he has just come back from the injury, but he's not fully fit, as you can see at the bottom of the screens there. Like, not even fit to come off the bench. So, big day then for the youngster. So, we've got this 18 year old Arezzo who's going to have to start the game. Just kind of worrying. I don't know if I should put someone else up there. But I do believe he's one of those players, like his finishing stats are excellent, but his just overall gameplay isn't the best. So hopefully we can get him through on goal. And if he's through on goal, there's a chance he'll score. Unlike the other strikers we've got, so Grebel's there. Similar, more of an overall player, but his finishing isn't good enough. And we put a lot of balls in the box, and Rezo's heading is very good. So hopefully he can get on the end of one even though he's not quite fit himself. So, massive game then. Second leg, need to score to get through, to have a hope of qualifying for the quarterfinals. And I feel like there's a wasted opportunity. If we get knocked out by Mutz and Gladbach, who are a very good team, excellent team, Jan Sommer, the, uh, the football manager legend. Uh, I'd be pretty disappointed if we go out, to be honest, because I thought we had a chance of getting through and playing one of the, the bigger teams in Europe. And it's all about that finance as well. We just do the extra cash flow because we've got no money at Valencia for whatever reason. Hopefully, with the, the success we've had last season and this season, it should go up. But yeah, Champions League money is key. Okay, so glad back on in amazing form. I'm guessing that's just based on the Champions League. Our form is better. That annoying loss to Granada just before this probably won't do our confidence much good. Got Vera on the bench to bring on. Correa, we'll have to bring him on at some point because Vass can't last 90 minutes. Gaia also gets tired quickly. So, massive game then. Second round, second leg of the Champions League. Saliba's already in the yellow. They've already got a free kick. This could be a long night. Oof. And Bello. Yeah, good challenge, good challenge. Is that the only highlight? Looks that way. Moving on. So, possession-wise, I don't expect us to have much of the ball as always. Just hopefully get a counter-attack, put one in. Looks all them to begin with. That was close. That was close. Hmm. Don't want to go for it just yet. I don't want to push on too much. I know, obviously, we've got to try and get a goal. We'll try and last the hour without conceding. Still be in the game, still be in the tie. Hopefully nick a goal and then we'll punch it for the last 20, 25 minutes. And just flip it to ultra attacking. Keep the two up front. Just can't concede. Oh, that should have gone in. No, he's offside. Guess at half-time 0-0, like, we're not really contributing much, so... Thinking about a tactical change for the second half. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Ah, oh, that's annoying. Just double clicked it. <laughs> what inspiring half time talk can you give him? This is a massive chance. Arezo beats his man. Needs support, needs support. Oh, God. It's better, though. Maybe silent treatment is good. I thought Saliba might have got the end of that. Likes to do that, doesn't he? Another corner to Valencia. It's a much better start to the second half. Cleared out. Vass. Bit of composure. Find an orange shirt. Nice. Soler. Back out wide. That wasn't the best ball to him, was it? Ooh, a lot of yellows. All right. Let's make these changes. 
shortly. Let's read that quickly. Okay, so slight tactical change. We go back to our 4 3 3. Because we haven't got any strikers to bring off the bench that are going to make a difference. So, I'm just trying to figure this out. He can get on there for his pace. Musaba get on the other wing for his pace. I'm going to put Sergio Gomez there instead. So, yeah. Vera, Saba out wide. That's better. Gomez through the middle. So, we've got pace on the wings. Bit of quality in there as well. Leave it as it is for a little bit. And have to flip it to ultra attacking, I guess, if nothing goes in. Because we need to score. We're going out. So, confirm changes. Hopefully, the subs can do the business. Hopefully, Maxi Gomez shows up. He's been very quiet so far. 20 minutes. I haven't had a shot on target yet. Come on. Need something to happen. Need something to happen. Need something to happen. This is the chance. Is this it? This would be huge. Oh, I lose it there. It's the problem with these people from the bench. Go, need a big tackle. Big tackle. Oh, not that big. That was on the edge. That was definitely on the edge. We are very attacking now. No, that was definitely outside the box. So we'll chill out on that one. It's got to be, surely. Well, now, now I'm doubting myself. Yeah, that's what I thought. Whew. Whew, it's close. Straight into the keeper's hands. Go on, big kick up pitch. Who's there? God, we're not, we don't look interested, do we? Uh, four minutes to go. It's going to run through. Ah, blew it. Champions League dream is over for another year. We're going to be back in it next season. I'm pretty sure of that, but that's pretty annoying. I'm not going to lie. Disappointed. I won't be too harsh on them. We've come to a very tough team away from home in Europe. Obviously, we're a very young side. We're not fully there yet. How we're winning the league, I have no idea. We just seem to do well against the teams that are around us. Um, What do you think? Of course, I'm... I'm what? <laughs> Stupid question. Spurs are out. We're out. It's a shame. It was a, I felt like it was a really good opportunity to uh, progress to the quarterfinals. But it's not meant to be. We'll concentrate on the league now. That's the only competition um, that we have available to us. So hopefully we continue our title push. Um, receive 8.68 million. See, again, like I could have done it. Finding it tough. I mean, he's a youngster. Leave him alone. We'll attend this press conference. I'll do it the next episode. That's fine. So scheduling-wise then, so as you know, we've got Atletico Madrid away next, which is a massive game. And then Batista at home for revenge because they dumped us out of the Spanish Super Cup. Barcelona on the horizon. And then if we can get through the Barcelona game, still on top, Catafé, Villarreal, Oviedo, Zaragoza, Derby game against Levante, and then Bilbao last game of the season. There's a chance we can maintain this four point gap at the top of the table we'll tune in to find out don't forget to subscribe guys sorry about the champions league still a chance of winning the title stay safe goodbye and i'll see you next time